no, I'm not hiding at all. People know I'm a adamant no. Like other life leaders in the General Assembly, State Representative Jeannie Ives is standing by her vote against legislation that would force taxpayers in Illinois to fund elective abortions for women on Medicaid and through the taxpayer subsidized insurance plans of state government workers. I think it definitely could backfire on some Democrats who are seen as just uh, fiscally negligent. This is a huge indicator that they really don't care about taxpayer money and spending it appropriately. While Illinois is struggling to stay financially afloat, Representative Ives points out that enactment of House Bill 40 could leave taxpayers on the hook for a $60 million a year abortion bill. So this is purely elective abortion. It could be for sex selection. It could be for any other reason, but taxpayers don't need to be paying for that. You know, the state's broke, and this is the last thing people want to spend their money on. Illinois taxpayers already fund abortions for cases involving rape or incest, as well as when the life of the mother is at risk. But if House Bill 40 becomes law, it will not only bankroll elective abortions, it will also make sure that abortion remains legal in Illinois, even if the Supreme Court overturns Roe versus Wade. I don't believe it. Uh, that that's going to happen anytime soon. And I don't believe that even if um, we tried to do that in the state of Illinois, that that would pass. House Bill 40 could be a wedge issue in the 2018 governor's race, especially if Governor Rauner vetoes the measure. But Representative Ives says for Democrats, it could have unintended consequences. Actually, this probably plays better, I think, for him with conservatives, and he needs that base in order to support him in the next election. And, uh, and I also think it really does play better with fiscally, cons fiscally concerned uh, Democrats even. I mean, they also don't want to spend money in this way. So I think he's in a, a safe spot by vetoing this bill. Call Governor Rauner and ask him to veto House Bill 40. We don't even want an amendatory veto on this. We want him to veto this, this bill entirely. Contact the governor's office in Springfield at 217-782-0244 and Chicago at 312-814-2121.